God, that was a stormy night. <laughs> I heard the rain in the middle of the night. Uh, torrential, it was like a thunderstorm. Uh, but it's a, like a tropical thunderstorm with the uh, immense heat that uh, the UK is experiencing just now and Europe. So, anyway, what's got to get done? And I need to get some paintings done for my EB shop. So, let's get a move on. This little beauty I'm going to be really sad to see that go. <laughs> so that's going off to France this one's off to France but I didn't just sell this I've got uh, other items that I've uh, been selling so I'll take you through and show you the rest of the items before they get posted let's go Through here, as usual, to my studio area. <laughs> I've got the lights all set up, that's bright, that's it. Got the camera adjust. Eh, uh, may as well show you this first though. I've got a live picture from Downing Street. Waiting on the announcement of the new UK Prime Minister, so that's a bit of news breaking news for the world today anyway on with this I says I was going to show you uh, the other items that I have sold can you get the words in there again and I've had to put the spot out because it's pitch black outside there's clouds everywhere I think the sun's going to come out and it's really really hot it's like tropical heat so they reckon we're going to be getting a heat wave so we'll see I reckon about maybe midday the sun will kick out Anyway, let's get on with this without further ado. Right guys, as you can see, move the light over a bit. Uh, just adjust the light a bit. Come on light. What about this? Oh, I'll put you down there now. There's how dark it is guys, I sort of show you big black clouds. Right guys, uh, it's a bit better now. I've sold another painting, one from my musical uh, haul series. This series I don't think I've actually been able to show you it so far because I had so much on my mind and so much to do. Uh, but before they're even getting sh uh, put in a haul to show you, they're selling off quick. So that one's called Having a Musical Day. <laughs> So there's, a, there's quite a few other uh, ones for this series, but that one's, uh, I think it's way off down to England, so that's superb. So that's two paintings in a row, two days in a row. This is Solid Silver. I think I've showed you in a haul before. It's a cigarette case. Uh, let's see if I can hold my up for his... <coughs> It's an old fashioned, it's a 19, I think it's 1920s uh, cigarette case. That's where the cigs would do event the cigarettes. It's solid silver. This I had up on eBay for, I think it was £135 to start with, and then I reduced it to 99 And it's well worth the money because it's solid silver, and you'll never see another one like it. So that one sold for £75 and it's off to Germany. Now, uh, I've got these candelabras set up here, but I'm going to do a separate haul for these uh, coming soon. So watch out for that coming soon. <laughs> Sorry about having to adjust the lighting all the time, but without this, I'll show you what it's like without the, without the, the, the light on. There you are. I mean, you can still see me, but with the light on, it's a lot better, so. Whew, get my breath back. Now, what was I saying? <laughs> my memory is away. <laughs> uh, oh, the candelabras. I'm going to be showing you a haul because I've got quite a few candelabras for sale. So I thought, since I've got them all together, no, I mean, before they get sold, I'll have a wee mini haul of candelabras and let you see 
the different varieties that you can get and the different prices. As I said to you, that uh, cigarette case is, I sold it for £75, so I'm happy with that. I still make a wee bit of money off it. I paid, I, paid, uh, I think it was 60 odd pound for that, so I'm still making a bit of money off it, you know what I mean? So I'm happy. But it's worth 150 anyway in an antique shop, so we're both happy and it's off to Germany. So the Kutze, I keep filming it because I want to keep looking at it, uh, looking back at it. And as you can see, as I says to you, it's got blue inners and whatever. But anyway, that's off to France. So one's off to Germany, silver, and one's off to France. So I am very, very happy. Anyway, I thought I'd show you them. And I've got one more thing to to look out, and that's get my phone. An elephant. A wooden elephant. So it's in this box here, so I'll let you wait through the box with me just to see what's in it and all. Because I've got to go, I've probably going to be at the bottom of that box, so I'll go through it with you and show you what's in that box as well. Right guys, um, <laughs> I've set up the camera on a tripod, I've got the spotlight above it, it's all set now so just zoom in a wee bit and we'll look through this box. That's the elephant I'm looking for. First of all we have a basket, a nice little wicker basket. <laughs> Where did I pick that up from now? Let's have a look. £2.25 for that. But anyway, I'm not going to go through all the prices, so. A little fashionable handbag. Now, look at this, guys. These are all my wooden animals. Some of them, anyway, because I've got uh, quite a few in another box. Frog. That's the as you can see guys, there's a lot. So I'm not going to go through them all right, but I can see what I'm looking for there. That's the elephant that I'm looking for. Nice, eh? Anyway, there's my box of wooden animals and that was full, so there's quite a few been sold. All handcrafted wooden stuff, so... Anyway, I'm not going to go through them all as I says, take too long, I'll do a haul maybe one day of them. But that's what I'm looking for, is that with an ele elephant. I think that's it guys, eh? As promised, I'm going to show you my candelabra haul that I promised. And yesterday I had great fun. I was out, I was thrifting, I was treasure hunting, and I got lots and lots of goodies. I'll give you a little quick peek. Guys, look at this. Haha. <laughs>
Hey guys, welcome to my candelabra hole <laughs> at long last, as promised. Now, I sell lots of these, uh, in fact last year I sold quite a few of these candelabras. I can't go wrong, if I see them, I buy them, I would buy as many as I could uh, all day long. Now, without further ado, let's have a look at these lovely candelabras. They're all lying <laughs> on the floor, look. Lots of them. So, get this camera adjusted so it's just nice lighting. Oh, the woes of a YouTuber. <laughs> right, let's go. We'll do a small one first. This has got a nice uh, gold, it's like a tint to a light, like a gilding. So that's the first one. Have a look at that. Isn't that lovely? And the pattern on the bottom. And you just imagine the candles. I've got candles on another candle over there, but I want to show you that one. All set up with candles, but you can just picture that on a nice dining room table or a, a sideboard. Or even a kitchen table, you know what I mean? Lovely. Nice gold or red candles on there, a nice uh, candle at dinner. Hence the reason I sell lots of these. This is a nice size, it's a, this is one of the smallest ones I've got. Yeah, the smallest. As you can see it's quite, quite uh, okay for a table like. You can imagine that, sitting on a, uh, just a table like that. I've got the tap in there so that shows up nice. So that's the first one. What a beautiful day it is as well, guys. I kind of get out how, because yesterday it was dull, but as I says, uh, yesterday I had a great day. I was out, I was, I was stiff. Now, it wasn't planned, it was, some, it was a, a Monday morning, you know what I mean? So I usually have a, a Monday morning where I gather my thoughts and I get work done that had to be done that I didn't do over the weekend because at the weekend I have a, a kind of, relaxing time at the weekend, you know what I mean? So, I usually catch up on a Monday morning. Anyway, as I says, I had a great time. That's another haul. Uh, I got some beautiful elephants and uh, brass candlesticks and blah blah blah, so... We've got enough with this haul today, but I'm just letting you know that I had a great day yesterday. You don't very often, as eBayers will tell you, you don't very often get a great thrifting day where you can go out and you kind of go wrong yeah, getting stuff, you know what I mean? And when you have that uh, day, you have to take the maximum uh, effort to, to get to get stock, you know what I mean? You've got to get, you've got to take that chance that day. If you leave it, then somebody else will get it, you know what I mean? So anyway, the next one I'm going to show you is quite a large candelabra and it's a gold gilted one again, as you can see. And this is uh, one, two, three, four, five. It takes five candles and it's so elegant. Now that's what you call a dining room table <laughs> candelabra, a centerpiece. You know what I mean? A centerpiece attraction. And you could have gold candles, red candles, white candles, whatever you want. You could even mix them up, you know what I mean? But that's the. I've never gave you a price. That uh, the smaller one, that'll probably go for probably anything for ten pound up to twenty, you know what I mean? Uh, in the teens range this is for fourteen ninety nine, fifteen ninety nine. Uh, depends I, what have I what have I got that up for uh, I'm not sure but I think I've got it up for about thirteen ninety nine or something, you know what I mean? This one here is uh, an exceptional one, so that's going for about thirty-seven and nine. These retail about seventy plus, uh, uh, brand new. Sometimes, sometimes more. You know what I mean, so I've half the price. So I've got this up, up I think about thirty-seven and nine or thirty-nine and nine, somewhere. Like it's just below the forty uh, mark. So that's the. I, I really like this one because it's different for the silver. You know what I mean, it's got the gold, as you can see. It's got the gold on it. So that's number two. 
I thought I'd sit on the couch today and do it. <laughs> I've got the light for the for the sunshine outside as well, so that's a bonus. Next one is a really large. This is heavy. This is an old old antique. This one. This is a a triple uh, candelabra. And as you can see, and the, I'm, I'm talking about the weight. So the weight of this for postage, I've explained on my eBay description that the postage is quite costly because of the weight. Uh, and I can't uh, seem to dismantle this one. Most of these candelabras dismant and go into a box, you know what I mean? A kind of flatter box. Uh, so, But look how elegant that is. Can you imagine that in the 18th century? The 17th, 18th century on someone's table with the candles lit. They had no electricity way back then, so the candles lit and it would, it would sparkle up the room and uh, show off the paintings and whatever. And uh, you could just see the people at the dining room table with their faces glowing with the candle light. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's me dreaming, you know what I mean? Looking back in time, as you know, I love history. Anyway, uh, and I watch all these shows, uh, Downtown Abbey and all that. You know what I mean? That's where I get a lot of ideas for. Uh, what's what I need to buy for selling and blah blah blah, but there you are. But look at the ornate work on that, isn't that lovely? And they've got the blue felt on the bottom so it doesn't scratch the table. But have a look at that, and that these candelabras, these are lovely. <laughs> I just love them. I think it's we're watching all these uh, costume drama shows like Downtown Abbey. Uh, pole dance, another one I'm watching recently, that's got a lot of uh, items in it that I, 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 I'm fascinated when I, when I look and I see inside the interior cottages and the houses and the big houses and that and I just see all these silver plate, you know what I mean? So it gives me inspiration to go and buy more. Now, I'll leave the big, I'll leave the big fancy one to last. I know, I know it's done there and it's got the candles in it so I wanted to leave that one to last but this is going to be a a shorter haul than, than most hauls I've got. But look at that one there. Now you wouldn't believe this guys. This was priced at 20 quid in the shops. Along with the bigger one I'm just going to show you. I bought the two of them. You've probably seen it in a vlog. I was looking in the window and I says on, on the, the vlog that I bought these two candelabras. Now, they were priced at 20 pound each in the second hand shop and when I went in, I didn't realise they had a sale on. When I did buy them, they were half price. They were, uh, the lady says, oh, they've reduced, they're half price. They've got a sticker on saying half price. So I got them for £10 each, which is a great bargain, you know what I mean? So there you are. This one had a label on it saying it was brand new. I polished, I think. <laughs> yeah, I did. I left a bit of polish there. Anyway, this one here is brand spanking new, had a label on it saying brand new and you can actually see it's brand new, it's never been been used I mean the felt's still there and there's no marks on it but there you are, look at that look how good that is isn't that lovely? right guys, I'm going to put this one down but you can picture that with a nice uh, red candles or white candles I've got white candles for this one I think anyway, on to the big one this is the other one I got for £10, it was 20 I remember but look at that, and I've left the candles on for days. <laughs> it's that big you can't get the candles in the shop. But look at that. Another one. And it's part of the brand new look. I don't think this is completely brand new like that one. It's been used, this one, but it's slight, slight new. And look at the fancy, fancy uh, metal work there. So, I think I've got another couple of candelabras, Ben, they're small ones, like the smaller ones I showed you. But I just can't uh, rate them out the new. I'm, uh, I've got a couple of parcels to deliver at the post office, so I thought I'd get this haul done for you so that you would see it. Because they'll probably sell, you know what I mean? And you'll never get the chance to see them all together like this again. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog on my candelabras. That's it in there. Just so you see it in the background there. I've got the red. The red candles in there, they're, they're, those are mark up my candles for display purposes for selling on eBay. I've got red, I've got white, I've got gold. Uh, I've not got blue yet, I'll need to try and look it for blue. Uh, but 
I'll leave you with looking at the smaller candelabra. Hope you enjoyed that. And it's not, it's not uh, usual for me to have them all like this in a pile together because as soon as I put them on, they sell straight away. So if you fancy one of these candelabras, my EB shop is linked in the description box below and you better hurry because it says, says to you, they go quick and I, I price them below, uh, well below what uh, other people in eBay are selling them for. As I says to you, I mean that one there, brand new, you're talking about £60. £50-£60 in a jeweler's shop, you know what I mean? Or a, 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 an interior design shop. When it's brand new like that, it could, could be more, you know what I mean? But, as I says, the big larger ones are 70 plus, uh, maybe maybe near the £85 mark, you know what I mean? But this one here, I'm selling for, I can't even, I think it's, about, it's just under £15, I think, so, uh, or £20, you know what I mean? So, anyway, you'll see yourself if you go in the description box below, so I'll leave you here, <laughs> and we'll go into the next part of the vlog, so until next time, bye-bye. <laughs> I don't think there is a nice part, part of the vlog, I think this vlog's long enough, so I'll go into the next uh, video vlog. Bye bye. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> Get these all back in their boxes again. <laughs>